Hey, what is going on, everybody? It's Yonks. Today, Zer is here in the tower because it is Friday. Now, I do not know what he has, but I do know where he is, guys. So let's go check him out. And it is about 6.30 in the morning right now, so it's pretty damn early for me. And I decided to see what Zer would have before I started the Division Beta. Yes, it does come out today, and I am super excited for that, guys. And I will be bringing you content on that game. But anyway, let's see what Zer has. What did he bring us last week? I think an exotic chest in Graham. I could be wrong, though, guys. Let's see what he has this week, though. All right, so he has some stuff. Let's start with the Titan helmet the imperium bellicose all right now the main perk here aiming weapons while airborne holds you in place with full super orbs recharge melee all right so yep while you aim your weapon while you look down sights in midair you will pause for a minute it's kind of like a uh, angel of light perk i think for the warlock i think that's what it's called and this helmet also does come with intellect discipline and you get gain bonus super energy from melee kills on minions of the darkness and replenish health when you pick Pick up an orb okay guys moving on to the skyburners annex now this is a hunter helmet this comes with intellect and discipline and the main perk here chance to create orbs on heavy weapon kills with a full super orbs may grant special ammo all right interesting helmet not the best out there for the hunter let's take a look since i am on my hunter right now okay guys now you also get gain bonus super energy from melee kills on minions of the darkness and replenish health when you pick up an orb. All right. Now we have the alchemist ram it for you warlocks. This comes with full intellect and the main perk here chance to gain glimmer on primary ammo pickup with full super orbs recharge grenade and melee. So again, another interesting, unique piece of armor here. And you also get reduced incoming arc damage and carry more ammo for special or heavy ammo guys on this chest so not too bad all right now moving on to the thunder lord now all right this is a pretty damn beastly machine gun and let's take a look at it so if you guys do not have this i suggest you pick this up if you have the strange coins there's no harm in picking this up because this thing is a beast but the only thing with this is the Quillum's Terminus from the raid from King's Fall is could do the same exact work as the Thunderlord without that exotic slap. Anyway, let's take a look here. So all Thunderlords will be arc damage. And we have Feeding Frenzy kills with this weapon. Increased reload speed for a short time. Great, great perk for a machine gun because they tend to have those slow reloads. Now we got Perfect Balanced. Field Scout, increased carried ammo capacity, and flared magwell reload this weapon even faster. All these perks in the middle are pretty good. I usually go with perfect balance and lightning rounds. Here's the main perk here. This weapon fires faster and more accurately the longer the trigger is held. All right, guys. Let's take a look at the aesthetics. It looks bad ass anyway guys so like i said before i suggest you pick it up if you have the strange coins and you don't have it already just pick it up you might as well guys it's pretty beastly now legacy engram all right so these are year one engrams only or, or if you're looking for year two stuff do not buy this guys if you are a collector and you're late into the game this is the thing you would pick up the legacy engrams if you are collecting that year one stuff. But if you're looking for year two stuff, do not waste your strange coins on this, guys. Now we have glass needles. This will cost you three strange coins, three motes of light, and one exotic shard. And this will change and alter your stats and perks on your exotic armor. So this, let's say you have sidearm, sidearm ammo on your exotic armor and you want sniper ammo just keep rolling these glass needles until you get that sniper ammo guys all right now i have three of coins i'm gonna go ahead and purchase one of these now i'll show you guys how this works like i usually do so right there that's the iron banner thing tempered i'm gonna pop a three of coins here and go back now exotic particles you have a chance to receive an exotic engram on your next ultra kill so usually when i'm doing strikes i'll pop one of these at the beginning of the strike or right before the boss and just keep going with that for every strike i'll pop one and this also does work with pvp matches i'll usually pop it like every other match at the end of the game you do have a chance win or lose guys now 
heavy ammo synths this will cost you one strange coin for three heavy synths now this used to be five before the taken king came out and they reduced it to three but it's still okay i suggest and highly recommend you guys stay stocked on heavy synths and special synths especially if you are big on raids guys now we have the vehicle upgrades we have the plasma drive and the stealth drive these will change a blue sparrow into a legendary spare and these are very very unique i don't see these too often this will also change the contrail color from the normal bland red to like a blue and here's like a pinkish pretty unique guys if you want to be different go ahead and pick one of those up now we have the mode of light exchange this will cost you two strange coins for one mode of light now i normally would not mess around with this because at this point of the game strange coins are kind of harder to come by and moats aren't too bad to come by so if you are really desperate in need of moats of light and you have strange coins lying around i guess go ahead and do it but otherwise i would stay away from that anyway guys that's really it for zur this week and yep i'll see you guys a little later i will be posting more stuff today but anyway guys that's it for zur and thank you guys so much for watching please leave a like on the video if you enjoyed the video and suffer the support i'd highly appreciate it